everyone. In this video, I will demonstrate various tools and search strategies for the CINAHL database in order to help you locate the various articles needed for your course. To get to CINAHL, you can select the link provided in the Nursing 378 Research Guide. If you are accessing the database off campus, you will need to log in with your W number and six digit birthday. When you select the link, you are redirected to the CINAHL Advanced Search page. We will discuss three different tools here, wording your topic, searching only allowed journals, and applying relevant filters. In the top search bar, you can enter your topic. You should consider if there are any synonyms or related terms to include. For example, if I am searching for research related to skin, then dermis, epidermis, and hypodermis, the three primary layers of skin, would also be related terms. If you are connecting synonyms or related terms, then you should do so with OR and parentheses. Using OR means you will find results that mention at least one keyword. The parentheses will help organize the search once we add in our additional components. For this search, I will enter skin or dermis or epidermis or hypodermis into the top search bar. In the second search bar, you can limit your results to only articles appearing in allowed journals. To do this, enter the title of the journal or journals in which you want to search. You should put the title of the journal in quotation marks, which will search for the exact journal title. You should put OR between each separate journal title. For example, if I wanted to search just the Journal of Advanced Nursing or Emergency Nurse, then I would enter Journal of Advanced Nursing or Emergency Nurse into the second search bar. I would use quotation marks around each complete title and put the whole thing in parentheses. Then select the drop down menu to the right labeled Select a Field. From the drop down menu, select JN Publication Exact. This change means the inner journal titles will be searched for only if they are exact matches. Underneath the search bars, there is an area labeled Limit Your Results. This area has many filters that we can use to further narrow our results based on particular needs. For your searches, there are four useful filters. The Publish Date filter allows you to specify a date range for your articles. For example, at the time of this recording, it is 2021. A five-year range would be from 2016 to 2021. I will enter 2016 in the box labeled Start Year and 2021 in the box labeled End Year. You do not need to enter a month. This will now limit my results to only articles published between 2016 and 2021. The English language filter allows you to specify that you only want articles published in English. You can select this box to apply this filter. The peer-reviewed filter allows you to specify that you only want articles from peer-reviewed journals. You can select this box to apply this filter. The Any Author is a Nurse filter allows you to specify that at least one author of your articles must be a nurse. You can select this box to apply this filter. At this point, we have fully prepared our search. In the first search bar, we have the keywords for our topic. In the second search bar, we have the journals from which we want our articles, and we have specified that we only want them searched in the JN publication area. We have four different filters, all of which specify different requirements in place. Now we can select the search button. My search has only 32 results. That is a small number, but I know that each of them meets the requirements I need. Here's an additional tip. Try the same search, but without the Any Author is a Nurse filter. Sometimes this filter will remove articles where the author actually is a nurse. You can remove the filter by going to the left-hand side of the screen where it says Current Search. In the area labeled Limiters, there is one that says Any Author is a Nurse. Select the X button to remove the filter. 
When I removed the Any Author as a Nurse filter, my results increased to 479. I can then check any relevant articles to see if the author is a nurse or not. To see the article's full information, select the article title from the result list. As an example, I will look at the second result on our list, Guide to the Prevention of Medical Adhesive-Related Skin Injuries. When I select the title, I am redirected to a page that lists its publication information, major and minor subjects, and usually an abstract. In the section labeled Affiliation, I see that the author is a nurse consultant. Since he is a nurse, this article meets all my search requirements. However, it didn't show up in my first search. I hope you find this video helpful in navigating CINAHL and locating the articles you need. As always, if you need any help, please don't hesitate to contact me.